Clock in, clock in. Black guy that just walked in. Yeah. He already dead. It ain't no need to check his fighters, bitch. He already dead. It ain't no need to check his fighters. Team Black got to stand up, man. Yeah. This got to be one of the worst times for YSL at this moment. You feel me? It's not really going too good. Not only is they going through this little Rico situation, I haven't really touched on this situation yet because I don't know what happened. But now we starting to see what they say actually happened with Lil' Key. And bro, what's crazy about this, Lil' Key was actually doing his thing. And he was definitely not slept on. I don't know if y'all know it or not, but Lil' Key is actually one of YSL's top performers. And if you want to ask Lil' Key what YSL mean, I bet you he gonna tell you YSL is a family. It's a label. It's a way of life. It's a lifestyle. It's not a gang. It's not a criminal organization. It's not a street gang either. It's not a mob. You feel me? Due to what they going through right now, it seems like they feel like YSL is everything this man says they're not. You know what I'm talking about? Nah, the situation with Lil' Key happened so fast. I don't know about y'all, but I was confused. But I guess it been confirmed or whatever. Lil' Key ended up passing away due to kidney and liver failure. Now, we got folks saying it's another one of these lean situations. Like, for real, though. Folks need to chill off of overdoing drugs, my nigga. People are grown at the end of the day. They gonna do what they want to. But fam, a cup of lean is equivalent to death. Not saying that Lil' Key was actually on lean and that's the reason why he passed. But Lil' Key, brother, Lil' Key made it clear that it wasn't because of that. And I believe Lil' Key even said he don't even do drugs. He don't do nothing. He drink water. Cause I don't do drugs. So you can have like kids, so you want to like, be able to feel a kid, you want to be able to spend that money, you want to be able to just, just change other lives. That's why I don't do drugs, because like, I don't know, my body can take all this I can't do all this I drink Hennessy, I don't smoke weed, I don't pop a pill, I don't do nothing. That shit was back then, when we were younger. Like, I ain't, I ain't doing shit, I don't need none of that shit, man, I don't use either. He say he don't do drugs, he just drink Hennessy. But on some real talk, Hennessy will do it to you too. You feel me? This is just a sad and out of the blue situation. I could only imagine what Young Thug is going through while hearing about this situation. Now enough of that, I'm pretty sure y'all already know about Money Yaya. You feel me? You can't forget her, you feel me? She might well be like 21 and, and, and get the knife on her head. She the only one we really know out here really stabbing folks. And not only stabbing folks, she stabbing folks by her boo, you feel me? We all know who her boo is. Young boy, stop playing. That's not only her boo, that's her husband, fiance, one on something. It might happen down the line. What's going on right now kind of shows that they still have a good relationship. So basically, one of her friends tried to talk to YB, and YB exposed her. You feel me? He is standing on big business. You is not gonna come between me and my children. You feel me? The hot Cheeto baby, after all. Thanks about milk sometimes, you feel me? He don't be too hot at you all the time. He was probably in the freezer when he wrote her. But she ended up saying, so which one of y'all lame ass wants to own up to trying to or actually talking to my baby daddy? Damn, from the looks of it, YB just dodged the coochie, y'all. He just dodged the whole butt. And y'all, y'all ended up, this is why Wild Mind is still here, why I still got mine. I'm going to love him loud and proud with a big smile on my face. Every time, regardless of how I look, to people who don't know what's really going on. Oh, that's so real, bro. Not only is money y'all, y'all ready to slice her, or whoever trying to mess with her baby daddy, she is also willing to go at the internet over him, you feel me? Now, if you ask me, bro, I don't know what the hell to think about their relationship because they have one of those relationships where you really ain't see them spaz out on each other. They actually be spazzing out on other people, you feel me, around each other, because of each other, if that makes sense. Because the only thing I heard young boy say about her was about her daddy. Only thing I can remember right now, her doing towards YB, a stabbing, a little side piece or whatever. I know Floyd gotta be upset with y'all, y'all. Instead of picking up the gloves, she picked up the samurai sword. But another video y'all brought to my attention 
is the baby, bro. Reason y'all brought this to my attention because we recently just did a video about the baby trying to kiss somebody. Baby, what is you doing, folks? You feel me? You keep trying to kiss people now. The last one. I really ain't believe it, but now it's becoming too much of a story to tell. Like, why does everybody keep saying he keep trying to kiss people on multiple occasions, you feel me? Now, this is the new occasion we about to see right now of him trying to kiss somebody. Let's see if he actually kissed anyone or actually tried to kiss them. Oh! No, ain't no way. Oh, this, oh, he real did try to forehead kiss her. She got up out the way. Hey. Her lace front was creaky. The baby. Her lace front was sideways like this. Baby. I think baby was just being nice. And she just overdid it. You feel me? Oops. No, screw me. Oh, man. That's crazy. Now, I don't know what to believe now at this point. But uh, I don't think the baby would actually... Randomly be trying to kiss people. I don't know if he do this for a joke. You feel me? That's one of his ways of getting off at people. You feel me? Or showing love to his supporters. You know, and he do it for fun. And he not really just trying to kiss everybody. That'll be weird, my nigga. And you need to brush your lip. You hear me? Don't be doing that. You feel me? But, from the looks of it, they making it look real funny. Because now it's like becoming a thing. You feel me? <laughs> but let me know how y'all feel about these situations in the comments below. I'm about done with that. Clock out, clock out. Black out it. Just walk out. Okay. I'm out here trying to get paid, but dog, I ain't got no kids. Ain't trying to be able to say your dog, I know that you did. Ain't out here doing no favor, dog. What you done did? I'm trying to get to the paper, dog. You know it.